Suicide Squad, Kill the Justice League gets Season 1 Roadmap, Joker coming on March 28. Today, Warner Bros. Games and Rocksteady have announced the updated Season 1 Roadmap for Suicide Squad, Kill the Justice League. It all starts on March 28, when Suicide Squad members Harley Quinn, Deadshot, Captain Boomerang, and King Shark will teleport to a brainiac invaded Elseworld to rescue and recruit an alternate reality version of the Joker. As previously announced, the Joker will be the first, and free, post-launch DLC edition for the playable cast. Gameplay-wise, players can expect him to wield a lot of explosives and a rocket-powered umbrella that he uses to propel himself through the air and glide across Metropolis. All Season 1 content will be set in an ever-changing Elseworld version of Metropolis featuring a distorted landscape reimagined in the Joker's image. Suicide Squad, Kill the Justice League Season 1 will be comprised of two episodes, each coming with new incursions and strongholds, missions and activities, DC supervillain-themed weapons, gear, and cosmetics, Justice League-infused Brainiac variant boss fights, and more. Episode 1, Fear will begin right away, on March 28, adding new gear inspired by the terror-inducing toxins and poisons of Scarecrow and notorious items featuring Mad Hatter, Merlin, and Dr. Psycho. Players will also find new mayhem and assault missions as well as a new type of incursion mission called Combat Incursions. Brainiac will unleash a host of new mutators, ramping up the challenge and forcing the squad to adapt to a new battlefield. Enemies will gain Green Lantern shields or even return from the dead if not handled correctly. Episode 2, Duality will be released as a mid-season update and includes a new mission type, new Green Lantern-infused enemies, new Two-Face infamy gear sets, and new notorious weaponry based on DC supervillains Reverse Flash and Black Manta. The first season of The Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League Live Service will also see the launch of a new weapon manufacturer called Intergang. Featuring close range, high damage weapons that shoot multiple projectiles with every shot, this manufacturer's weapons make for devastating close quarters builds. Players will see weapons of different rarities drop from this manufacturer, including some existing legendary weapons.